Yes, this is a pentatonic stick, you see. Even though it's two months away. But it's real. It's mine. Hello humans! School holidays are over and that is very upsetting because it means that I'm gonna have to go back to school and all the expectations that school places on you. I hate it. Not school. I like school. I hate the expectations. So today, in honour of going back to school and all those stupid expectations that they place on you, I'm gonna be doing another open letter to society called Expectations. If you guys don't know why I said another open letter to society, um, that's unfortunate for you. If you have a spare seven minutes, you can go and watch my previous open letter to society. Uh, I talked about self-image, and that was interesting. That was almost ooh three months ago. It's high time to do another one. Here we go. Dear society, I'm gonna be frank. I hate being told what to do. I don't mind being taught new things. That's not an issue. The issue is when I want to do something and someone else tells me to do something different. It's a character flaw, really. It's possibly even my Hamasha, but that's not the point. Something else that comes on an equal level of dislike along with being told what to do is being rushed. If I'm running around getting ready in the morning and someone is pressuring me to go faster or to hurry up, I'm just gonna balk things are not gonna end well. Just don't rush me, I'll get there. And you society, you have found and placed me in a compulsory situation that mixes both these things together. That situation being, having to choose my career or set planning. Set planning is when you sit in a classroom for half an hour and get lectured all about choosing good universities and OP pathways and the trade center and apprenticeships and choosing good subjects and senior. It's, it's basically just pain, pain and stress. Society, I am 15. It has been 15 years since I exited my mother. 15 years since I took my first cry on the earth. And I still have a minimum of two and a half years to go before I finish high school, before I enter the real world. Two and a half years is a long time. Two and a half years is 30 months, is 130 weeks, is 910 days and 1,310,400 minutes. And this is the amount of time I have left at high school. This is the minimum amount of time I have left to decide what I want to study at uni, if I even want to go to uni. Maximum amount of time to decide? I don't even know. I doubt there even is one. But with this much minimum time left, why is there all this pressure right now? I understand that we need to be prepared and that you and our teachers just want to give us our best shots. I get that. I, I appreciate that. I understand that you're trying to get us to think ahead, make the most of our lives and our abilities, not to waste time. I get that and I appreciate that greatly. However, I think you're going about it all wrong. I'm not an educational expert, but I am a product of the educational system. It's important to know about OPs and ranks and universities, but it's also important to know that it isn't for everyone. Instead of making us sit through an hour of sessions a week, why not just give everyone a basic intro to the post high school schooling area and then make it clear that if we want to go to university, it would be very beneficial for us to come and speak to you. Instead of giving us worksheets to fill out with our decisions on subject choices and courses at university, and career, give us tools and time to come and hash it out with you. Again, make it clear that if you don't want to go to university, you don't have to do this. Don't put us through extra stress that we don't have to go through. We're not all the same. Please don't marginalize us. Sincerely, Bella Rankin. Well, that didn't get heated at all. So yeah, guys, that's all I'm gonna say today. Um, I've kind of worked myself into a bit of a rant now, which is not a good idea, so I'm gonna stop. Um, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, because I'm keen to make more of this kind of stuff. And the reason I make these videos is because I want to see if any of you guys feel the same way. These videos are kind of like my mating call to other humans who feel passionately about the things that I feel about. That's why I say like, comment, and subscribe. Not because I want to be famous or make money from ads or, you know, any of that weird stuff. Because I genuinely want to know what you think. And I genuinely want to see if people think the same as me. I love you all and goodbye. I don't even know. <laughs> oh, I'm really tired. I don't want to go back to school. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to change my shirt. And then I'm going to film Fangirl Friday. Because that's how you do things, you change your search so it doesn't look like you filmed on the same day even though you did.